DNA history. We're going to lock the ladies in the six-sided cage, and we're going to turn them loose. I can't wait for Gail Kim and the pride of Tennessee, Miss Jackie Moore. Are you kidding me? Those two in the cage? Come on! Boy, talk about an intimidation factor from the leader of Rude Incorporated, Robert Rude, and we just witnessed that in the locker room area. Robert Rude forcing Eric Young to sit in a corner like a child being punished. I mean, Robert Rude, we know that he owns Eric Young's contract and he controls his wrestling career, but this is over the top. Oh, it's his way of the highway. You see, right away, Gail Kim goes right after Jackie Moore. And look at this, Petey Williams right after Robert Rude. Great strategy. They don't even want to wait. They just went right at him, Mike. It's what we've come to expect from Gail Kim and the pride of Tennessee, Miss Jackie Moore. Boy, you talk about bad blood. That's, that's what we've seen from these two women for the better part of the last few months. So many people are talking about these two going to be finally... Whoa! What a... He just snapped off the hurricane runner right over the top of the rope. And then a beautiful knee dropped right there by Gail Kim. Man, Mike, it's just gone crazy from the beginning. Well, check this out. Gail Kim takes the head of Jackie Moore and continually drives it into the canvas. Uh-oh, uh-oh, look out. Here comes Rude. Wait a minute. So focused on doing the damage to the pride of Tennessee, she doesn't see Robert Rude at all. Oh, man. Just slapped her. Come on. He just backdrop suplex Gail Kim in essence, taking her out of this tag team, this mixed tag team match. Oh, and now Petey Williams is, the numbers game is good. Oh, but Petey Williams goes right after it. Perfectly places the knees into the chin. Now measuring Rude, dares him to get to his feet. And as soon as he does, Petey charges across the ring. Lit a series of right-hand shots, but oh, from behind, the pride of Tennessee, Ms. Jackie Moore rakes the eyes. Oh, oh just turned him inside out. What a running clothesline as you saw Petey Williams close we around and Andrew Thomas, referee Andrew Thomas, checking on Gail Kim. I think she's really hurt bad after what Robert Root did to her. Root back on the offensive. A series of shots has Petey Williams reeling in the corner. Going to try and take him across and no, quick reversal. Back first into the corner. Who's going to prevail in the mixed tag team match? We'll find out when we return to Impact. Warning, viewer discretion is advised. Eight brutal matches, six sides of steel, one barbaric night. Kurt Angle's team wages war against Christian's army inside the infamous lethal lockdown. And for the first time in TNA history, Team 3D and LAX will step inside the electric lockdown, where 10,000 volts of electricity will pulse through the six sides of steel cage. TNA presents Lockdown, this Sunday on Pay-Per-View. Welcome back, everyone, to Impact. Continuation of the mixed tag team matchup. The pride of Tennessee, Miss Jackie Moore. Right hands and left hands to the back of the Canadian destroyer, Petey Williams. But Petey just couldn't take it anymore. But you saw the blind tag from outside by Robert Roode, and then he rakes the eyes of Petey Williams. As you see, Robert Roode right here, getting the momentum here on Petey Williams. You gotta be thinking about lockdown as these two are gonna be locked inside the steel cage. Will Petey Williams be able to find a way to use that Canadian destroyer, that six foot pile driver? Or will Robert Rude of Corpus, we see Gail Kim being helped up the ramp, but she's obviously hurt bad, Mike. And you know, in recent weeks, Don, we have we have talked about Petey Williams possibly being the secret friend of Eric Young. I mean, I think that's still a very distinct possibility. Well, they've got such history between them. I think it's obvious that you see Gail Kim, she got to her feet. Obviously shakes off the cobwebs, goes right after Jackie Moore and just whip pulls her right inside of the ring. And look at the anger, the determination on her face. Oh yeah, just another little taste of what we're going to see this Sunday at Lockdown. Senior official Rudy Charles between the two ladies. Petey Williams just connected. Kick to the back of the head of Rudy. Oh, that hesitation drop kick. Oh, he just slammed it right into the back of Robert Rudin. You can see now. Oh, he's going for the side rush and leg sweep, but he hits it perfectly. Robert Root just got nailed in the back of his head as Andrew Thomas is just caught in the middle. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Tennessee Cowboy James Storm up on the apron. Petey Williams, look out from behind, Petey. Quick roll up by Root. Pin, two. Oh, they get the win.
action. See there, the Robert Roode able to steal one as Cowboy James Storm came in and was able to screw Petey Williams. And now look at this. As well, right here comes the Wildcat. And they're going to be in a blindfold match this Sunday. And look at him clean it house. You're right. The two former members of AMW to square off Sunday. But now the Wildcat has the pride of Tennessee high up in the air hole. Flip from behind by James Storm. He took too long there, and James Storm saw it. And now look at the right, as you see. Eric Young at the top of the tunnel. Looks like he had a chair in his hand. He does. As he's coming down towards the ring, and he gets inside. Well, remember what Rude told him. He said, sit there. Sit in that chair and don't move. I can't believe that Eric Young is standing up to Robert Rude. Come on, Eric. Just hit him. Crack him one right across the face. This guy deserves it. Look at that wild look in Eric Young's face. I swear he's going to do it. Hit him. Look Finally, he's got a mind of his own. Put the chair down. Look at that look. I own you, and I'm telling you, put it down, or I'll make sure you never wrestle again in your life. Don't put it down, Eric. Come on, go on. Come on. I mean, he's got to, Don. Think about it. His career's at stake here. You're right. He's in a tough spot right there. Let's send it to the back. JB trying to get word with the fallen angel, Christopher Daniels. Good luck, JB.